Mickey McFist. Now there was one tough pug. Loved the ladies and the booze, not to mention the ponies. A great fighter, not such a great gambler. Wish I'd bet the opposite of every bet Mickey made. Heck, I'd be a freaking billionaire today. Anyway, that's where his trouble started. Too many bets, too many losses. He was in deep to the local loan shark and getting behind on the vig. Something you never want to do. One day, Mickey's working away at the bar when Bronto shows up. He politely asks Mickey for that week's home payment. Mickey's a tad short, but Bronto understands and gives him an extra day. These two go way back. Payback time, Mickey! I'm down, but never out. You'd think Mickey would have handed the cash over to Bronto. Instead, the moron invested it. Maybe Bronto would have taken that car as a payment, but Mickey decided to do a little body work to it first. Anyhow, Bronto let him slide on the bank for another day, but not before making sure his buddy Mickey was all right. Chips are stacked against you. <laughs> you can't con a con man. Mickey finally made the payment, but he was late, and that meant an extra charge to work off. Brando's boss had a bet on Mickey to win the third round and buy a KO. And if Mickey was smart, that's what he'd do. Notice I said. If. I feel a lucky streak coming on. No worries, love. I've always got an ace up my sleeve. Thinking the loan shark would have had the fight fixed, Mickey bet everything he had on himself. A sure thing, right? Well, he was right about the fix. Just before the fight, Pronto had some new orders for him. Lose. If I was you, I'd take a dive. This fight's a sure thing. Screwing the loan shark's fix wasn't the smartest move. Like you'd figure, Bronto had some new demands. Mickey bet his bar against the loan shark's losses, or he'd buy it cheap after Mickey's funeral. Of course, Bronto was gonna make damn sure Mickey was in no shape to win. I'll run you into the ground. I'll wager you're just a one-trick pony. Mickey figured he'd saved his bar and paid his debt. But scumbag loan sharks don't like to lose, and this one was no different. Bronto was sent in to make sure Mickey didn't leave that room in one piece. Tough luck, Mickey, but the house always wins. I'm a long shot, but I'll pay big. Bronto walked in the next day with some good news for a change. The loan shark bet on Mickey to beat Bronto and won back all his losses. Mickey was free and clear. Like most things that happened to Mickey, this called for a drink. Like I said, these two go way back. <laughs>